Good afternoon everyone. Uh, we are in one garden in Brighton. It's in Stammer Park. It's a free to see garden so we're just having an explore of this little garden while we are here. As I say it is free to get in but do bear in mind you do have to pay for parking. I've just paid for two hours parking and that was three pound. Anyway join me as we explore one garden in Brighton. One Garden is probably one of the best free gardens you can go to in Brighton. In 2021, following a very big restoration project, One Garden was open to the public to come and enjoy it. It's now managed by Plumpton College and includes many different gardens that you can see. And there's also a really nice restaurant and farm shop on site. One Garden is accessible by public transport by using the many buses that do run in Brighton and the nearest located train station is Falmer train station, which is about a mile and a half from the One Garden. One Garden was also designed by an architect called Dominic Cole, who's also worked on the very famous Eden project in the UK as well. One of the great things about the One Garden it is a host to many events that do happen throughout the year. When I was there, there was many sort of marquee stalls that were selling various products that you could purchase. After taking a stroll through the various gardens here, I then come across the One Market, which is a farm shop and it also has a garden centre attached to it. Here you can find many locally sourced products to buy. Oh, what a glorious day today, I can't complain. So I've just come out of the One Market and I've got some kombucha, as you can probably see on the screen. Um, it's vegan, it's local made, so I guess it's fresh and it's made in Sussex. So I'm just gonna have some and enjoy this, especially in today's weather. It is absolutely glorious today. Cannot complain about the weather. because we've had a not great summer in the UK, if I'm honest with you. But yeah, let's try this now. Let's have a drink. Cheers, everyone. Mm. really good it tastes more like alcohol than anything but it's not alcohol it's probably got a trace of it in but really good really recommend it kombucha three pound definitely get one in the one market if you're here we've got like a little bridge walk here which is really interesting i have to say Excuse me, that kombucha is making me burp a lot now. Yeah, this is uh, really beautiful. After finishing off my walk around this lovely boardwalk, I then discovered the pond they did have here, which I have to say looked rather stunning. I have to also to say that the sun does really bring out the colours in these plants. They all look absolutely beautiful.
After finishing walking around the gardens, we slowly made our way over to Stammer House. We also saw a beautiful Rolls Royce on the way. I'll tell you more about Stammer House in the next clip. <clears throat> so guys, this is an interesting building in Stammer Park. This is called Stammer House. Uh, basically, it's like a wedding venue and there's also a restaurant inside as well. So if you do fancy a bite to eat, check out this place as well. This is Stammer House in Stammer Park in Brighton. And we've also got a really, really nice uh, seating area just outside Stammer House as well. So you can sit there and eat to your heart's content as well. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that tour of One Garden in Brighton in Stammer Park. Really interesting place to see. It's free to get in. Obviously, £3 for the parking. Can't really complain about that. It's only been open since 2021, so even though I'm fairly local, I haven't, haven't really been. But yeah, really enjoyed seeing that. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.